Good morning, my name is Sophie and I'm a political executive on the content team here at de Havilland and I'm here to give you your third COVID-19 roundup. So this morning, the story that's naturally dominating the headlines is the support package for the self-employed that was announced last night. Chancellor Rishi Sunak has announced that the self-employed are set to receive 80% of their earnings, up to £2,500, although crucially this package won't be available until June. Alongside this, the government has effectively suspended the housing market, telling people in the early stages of buying or selling to delay the transaction and adding that no visitors should be allowed on properties, including estate agents, surveyors, and importantly, people who want to buy the homes. Meanwhile, the NHS is set to start using big tech firms such as Amazon and Microsoft to help them predict where ventilators, hospital beds, and medical staff will be needed the most. In some more uplifting news for you, the NHS volunteer target has been raised to 750,000 people after over half a million people signed up within the first 24 hours. And finally, in what's perhaps the most devastating news since Eurovision was cancelled, the Lib Dem leadership race has been postponed until May 2021 to allow the party to focus on the current coronavirus crisis at hand.